How will it be? Chakuaje manze? How have you been? It's been a while, it's been a while, but karibu tena. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is John Duty, where everything, life, maju, happens. Manze, nikonambio na ujamabado anakam. Where are you going? I'm already in the lane and you are so fast. I'm not actually talking to you. There's a, there's a red car behind me that is coming very, very fast. Keep calm. Kuam pole uone kesho. So, ladies and gentlemen, um, ladies and gentlemen, today is a road trip to San Marcos. So, I am coming from San Antonio to San Marcos in Texas. Nilisikia kuna mtu alibonga mbaya pale tu TikTok. Akisema naishi kajado ya America. Ha? San Antonio, yes, um mostly I honestly agree and accept the fact it's a kajado of America for Americans. Kajado of America is we shall go of America. It's very dry. You know, no much fun buzz or activity going on. But San Marcos, I've never been to San Marcos. Mimi ni mgeni Texas, I'm just, I've just been here for a few months. Just been here for a few months. And I'm visiting different towns. I'm visiting different, different towns. Just to get a, a feel or, or, of how it is. So come out to Texas. If you live in Texas, comment below your town, and I will be in your town shortly, very, very soon. Mtalini ali epoa ni ba na we we. Mtali ni ali epoa ni. Charity begins at home. I I have to see home and see everything that I entails on Texas before I leave Texas because I know Texas is huge. And it will be a disservice to you, my audience. If I left Texas, Nasjawanesha, and I have not shown you different places. So, this is my adventure as well as, well as it is yours. And definitely, we are both going to experience it. Woo. So basically, from my location, that was 30 miles. 30 miles. I'm here to convert. Let me convert miles to kilometers. But basically 30 miles, it's a one hour drive, one hour, 19 minutes drive from where I was in San Antonio to San Marcos. It's going to be a good ride in Americano. I'm going to show you the views now. Manana, okay?
Wadao. How will it be, my people? It has already been. So I just wanted to let you know that I got to Texas safely. Got to San Marcos, Texas safely from San Antonio, Texas. Tulifika Salama and everything has been right. And I am at Toyota. Toyota San Marcos. Toyota San Marcos. And guess what? I am looking for a ride. This is the ride that I'm looking for. So I want to update my people. Eh? Tell me if this is going to be a deal or not. It's a clean car. It's a 20, a newer model for a Toyota Highlander, as you can see. Previously, that's my, that's my car over there. That's my car. It's still a Toyota Highlander, but an older version of Toyota Highlander. And this is the newer version of Toyota Highlander that I want to get. It's a seven-seater. Some of the parks it has. Um, seven-seater. New wheels. Replaced alloys. Uh, so yeah, this is how things look in Texas, San Marcos. At a Toyota dealership at San Marcos, Texas. If you're looking for your Toyotas, Highlanders, Raffos, this is your style, bro. This is a nice color, bro. Kwanza Mukamba. For us Kamba people, we definitely love the colors. We love red, maroon. We love green, yellow. Those are our dominant colors. Let me see about this. Highlander Hybrid LE. Yeah, this is a newer model, my friend. Yeah, definitely way much newer. This is a Highlander, but hybrid. That that means this is a 2022. That's a smart car. Limited all-wheel drive. Definitely smarter with a bigger ass. This is LE hybrid. So definitely all this line is for Toyotas. This is hybrid LE as well. Yep. It's better, it's faster. A nice here. So basically all these are Highlanders. And that's what I've been that's why I came to San Marcos in Texas to investigate and see if we can lock in a deal yes so um, make sure that you have your figure in your mind do not share the exact details of how much you want to pay per month your premiums let them give you the numbers based on your credit score um, the other thing hey bro I don't know what's happening look behind me so many freaking birds wanna look like the Holocaust Hey, hey. So yeah, um, all those birds, I don't know what's happening here. Something might be attracting them. Nice. So yeah, um, so key things, yes, you've gone to your bank. And if you have a car, oh, three factors. You've gone to your bank, make sure the bank tells you how much they are willing to offer and at what interest rates. Definitely they will do a soft inquiry on your credit. Make sure you let the bank know first before you go to the dealership. If you go to the dealership without letting the bank know, this is what will happen. They will send your credit to so many banks. They will, your credit will be pulled by four to five banks. That will hurt you so much to recover that credit. So you need to talk to your only bank that you trust so that your credit is only pulled once. Number two, don't put your cards on the table. Don't tell them how much you can afford or how much you want to put down um, per month, for instance. And the good thing with going to the bank is that the bank is able to tell you what you qualify for so that even you have your own figure in mind. But saying, I can only do this um maximum of this or minimum of this bro no they will now use your numbers against you and basically you're done number three if you have your own car 
Huh? If you have your own car that you love, I love that baby behind me. This baby, I love her. She makes me happy. So if you have your own car that you'd like to trade in, bro, get an offer from someone else or another company that buys vehicles. Get your own offer, get your check separately, and use that check to finance your vehicle. But do not trade in your car. Honestly, do not trade in your car. They will give you a poor offer. Or if you trade in, make sure you already have an offer from a valid people who buy cars, not a dealer shop, so that at least you know how much your car is worth. Only that way, you will know if you're being played or not. So if you're having a trading, just um, bargain or discuss on the aspects of the car without the trading. Just the newer car that you're buying without your trading. Your trading, sell your trading separately, use your car to offset the loan. You'll be way much so happier. And those three factors will set you apart from any other car shopper. So once we... We are still in the first stages of the deal. Once we finalize that, we'll let you know. I've been your host, John Duty, and it's been my pleasure of traveling with you to San Marcos, Texas. I hope we seal this deal. Mashallah!